Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Freeholds Raceway here on Thursday afternoon. It is January the 19th, 2017. You can look at race number four from Freehold, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5 for more selections from racetracks across the world. The fourth race from Freehold is a claiming 5,000 here. Field of eight pacers traveling one mile, purse $2,600. Um, there's exact trifecta, super fact wagering and uh, I'm gonna give you a super fact of this race um, I'm gonna go as a top pick I'm gonna go to the two horse uh, number two big puff doggy I'm gonna include him into a super fact at two four five three two four five three but number two big puff doggy seven to one Eric Abatello owns trains and drives this seven-year-old gelding uh, this uh, 13 year old gelding excuse me I was looking at the wrong horse for a second but he's a 13 year old gelding and uh, he's been around the block a few times but he made his second start of the year last week at freehold uh, on a good going uh, in a 5,000 claimer the horse finished eighth by 16 lengths from the eight hole basically sat last all around it wasn't his good start um, he, he gets the inside today I think that should be the key to this horse's victory start before on the 5th of um, January here at Freehold in a 5,000 claimer. Horse finished second by two and a half, uh, by half length that day. From the off the gate, this horse got second. Most of the race was basically second. It got taken over a little bit to go back to third, but brought back second. Really wasn't, wasn't catching the winner meatloaf who ran well. Meatloaf is running in this race, breaking from post position number six. But um, I really think this horse should do well. His last victory came his, in his last start of 2015 or 2016 at uh, Freehold, the 8th of uh, December, at a 5,000 claimer. Horse won by half length. He did run some, a very slow time of two minutes and two fifths of a second. But you know he got he got it done. It was a very nice victory. He had four victories in 2016. And, um, um, his best time came 158 and one at Freehold. You know he's not a very fast horse, but I think he could really do well here today um you know he, he's always up there with the money um you know he's back at a, a better post position um seven to one i think he can maybe upset here today so i'll use him as the top pick so to recap my bets for race number four from freehold raceway gonna go with the two horse big puff doggy gonna go two four five three two four five three in the super factor so good luck to all and follow me on twitter at horse racing kid five good luck everybody